YouTube, I'm back with an exciting review. This is something I was personally looking forward to, the Patty Cuts Edition Babyliss Trimmers with the black-like, diamond-like, carbon-like, deep tooth-like, super dope blade. And spoiler alert, guys, the blade is good. It is very good for lining up. The main difference is the blade and this rubber grip that's around the clipper trimmer. Uh, and it is a nice, very durable foam. It doesn't look like it's gonna rub off or fall apart. So I did not know Mr. Patty Cuts was Irish, so I'm in the back reading his bio, and I uh, got 118,000 Instagram followers, which is about 118,000 more than me. Go ahead, subscribe to the channel, guys. Uh, you know, we're trying to get up there like him. Anyhow, the rest of this information is in another language. This is a side-by-side -side comparison of the two blades, so you can see them up close and personal. The black one uh, seems to be a little bit deeper tooth, and uh, it seems to have like a nice little coating on it. It is a smooth blade. Check them out. All right, this is them in action, and it takes little to no pressure. These are pretty zero gapped out the box, uh, and just watch them work right here. And I'm gonna actually compare these with the original, so I'm just doing a little swoop. I haven't even cut the hair, trimmed anything down, so I'm just going at it raw. That's how we do it around here. We go in raw, and you see that you know the corners of the blades are nice and sharp, and uh, very little effort. You just kind of let the blade glide over the skin and it gives you a nice sharp line as you can see right here. With these, we're going to bald out the bottom a little bit. I would say they're, they, they're not as good to bald with because I think they're a little sharper. So here is the original Gold FX. Now these are about a year old and they're not as zero gapped. But you can see the cutting comparison between the two. And one thing I do notice is that the Black Blade, the Patty Cake Edition, gives you a nice crunch sound when you're lining up. And if these guys weren't playing copyrighted music in the background, I would let you hear it more. But because we're always playing music, they'll flag me. So I do have some, uh, some sound with these. You can hear them soon. Here we're doing the front line. And uh, yeah, man, they these line up sharp, sharp as can be. And here's the originals, which there was nothing really wrong with the originals anyway, but I, I would say this blade is, is a better blade, especially for shorter hair. It works really, really sharp. Here we go. We got this with a little bit longer texture hair in the front. And you can actually hear that crunch sound while I'm working on this one. Anyhow, I have a full review on the original Babyliss Gold FX trimmers. And I'll leave the link in the description. And if you have any information about the, the trimmers in general, it's got about 65,000 views already. So you could check that out. But yeah, guys, this is the blade. The handle is, is very, very, very comfortable. It takes away some of the vibration from the, from the trimmer, you know, and it, you know, takes it away from hand fatigue. It's a nice little soft dampening. And uh, the paint job is amazing. Either way it goes, if this is your first pair of trimmers or you're getting another pair just for lineups, you cannot go wrong with these trimmers. And we want to support companies that are supporting barbers. And uh, shout out to my boy Patty Cuts who got to the level to where he has his own trimmer. 
and support him in the barber community for having companies feedback from barbers so that we can have better clippers all around and I'm out of here this is another review no I didn't retire that was an April Fool's joke and I'll catch y'all on the next one peace